Mama Dangote has come out and confirmed Diamond Platinum's private wedding that took place in the mid of this week. All this and more after this. <laughs> Welcome to East Africa Social Television. How are you guys and where are you watching this from? I go by the names of Ara D, who happens to be a presenter on a daily basis onto this channel. And if at all you're watching us for the very first time, endeavor to go to the lower right bottom corner, smash the subscription button after smashing it, hit the notification bell that will enable you to get notified each and every time I upload a video onto this channel in there. Now we are again back to Tanzania. We did a little bit of a stream of 10 minutes about Harmonize and Frida Kajara where Harmonize is really craving for Kajara to come back so as he gets music back to have to his fans in there for you. Something that I really called out in this video. If I told you missed out, you can as well watch it. It's the first video that we did today and now we are into Tanzania. Again, it looks like Tanzania is taking on everything by storm. But remember, Akothe celebrated her birthday yesterday and happy belated birthday, Akothe, the boss lady. She has made 41 years of age and she is really growing on well. And towards her birthday, she was really, she landed a very multi-million deal in there that she is sponsoring a certain a certain company that is so much into wheat flour in there and she is trying to promote it in there for you and she was with Nelly Oaks in there for you the new boyfriend and lover was her manager and they got back together last year in there so we get into the diamond platinum story in there mama dangote has really come out and confirmed about diamond platinum private wedding that took place in the middle of this week remember we came out and broke that story on east africa social television and very many people are really watching it till now the video is one of the most viewed on this channel that diamond platinum's in a private wedding and this news was broken by diamond platinum's friend who goes by the name of juma lokole live on wasafi media in there for you and he broke it and said that on wednesday this week diamond platinum's is walking down the aisle in a private wedding in there for you with a mysterious woman from zanzibar you remember that very well mysterious woman from zanzibar and she's influential in tanzania and how come being influential and we don't know you that's why people came in and said that might be zuchu in there for you and zuchu has come out and said nothing about this allegation the same applies to their blood terms but the mother has come out and confirmed to us that this wedding took place in there for you in a post that she took on her instagram in there for you and she has also told them that Save the date, 11th April 2020, Regency, level 8, that is in Dubai, that is where a big reveal is going to be made by Diamond Platinum's in there for you. That is Hayati Regency Hotel in there at level 3, that's where it's going to happen in there for you. And she promises people that maybe the Mugole or the bride is going to be unveiled by Diamond Platinum's on that day, something that I've not yet picked on because I really believe that they are trying to build a story to see to it that Diamond Platinum's hits loads of views on social media because each and every time Diamond is the news, you see what that makes her music move because right now it has an EP and the only way to push this EP in the ears of people is simple. Go ahead and keep it in the eyes of these people, all ears of these people. Keep the name Diamond Platinum in there. The more it's being talked about, the more it's really, 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 really making rounds on social media and it will come out and go to the levels that expect it to be. That is Mama Dangote in there for you. So Diamond Platinum is using this. According to me, Diamond Platinum is doing, using this to push, to push your EP such that it doesn't gate out of people's knowledge in there for you and Diamond Platinum's too took it onto social media and posted 11th April 2022 Hayat Regency in there that he's going to be in Dubai we don't know level 8 I don't know what's going to happen at level 8 at Diamond Platinum he said where there is destiny is Allah in there we don't know which destiny Diamond Platinum is chasing in there but I really believe that we need answers and we are fed up of stunts we are paid off of stats because Diamond Platinum and Zuju first put up a stunt that on 14th February they are going to marry one another and nothing happened. 
Diamond came out and told us that he's seeing someone who's not Zuchu. He sees Zuchu like his sister. And so on and so forth. That's what Diamond told us. And now they are back to their game again of playing their cards. But this time around, I really believe they are not playing their cards right. They are not playing them right. That's what I really think. Because if they are playing them right, they would have known that they are really, 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 really doing something that is not okay to the fans. Because you are making people overweight. You get however much. You know you are not loving one another. Diamond is using the card of Zuchu to fake all of us. And we know that Zuchu is not the type of woman that Diamond Platinum dates. You get that's not the type of women that Diamond Platinum dates because Zuchu doesn't have any of the qualities that Diamond Platinum dates. When you look at Zari, Zuchu is no is nowhere near Zari. She's no she's nowhere near Wema Sepeto. She's no way near Tanasha Dona. She's no way near Hamisa Mobeto. No way. Diamond likes light skinned women with who are pervicious and bootlicious that's what diamond goes for unless otherwise he has changed his taste but his taste is like zari tanasha dona hamisa mobeto and when you look all, when you look at all of those they all have certain things certain features in common that zuchu does not have and i really believe that diamond cannot make a very big mistake of his career to go in and marry zuchu no way no way because Diamond right now, he doesn't want marriage. However much in the African setting, marriage gives you respect, but Diamond Platinum doesn't want that. What Diamond needs is to see to it that he gets someone who is going to put him to a level of where he wants to be. To be competing with the likes of his kids, Banner Boy, his kid and Davido. And I really believe that Zuchi isn't that kind of person. You saw when he got, when he got Zari Hassan, he was not appreciated so much in Uganda, and ever since he got, ever since he got Zari Hassan, Diamond Platinum started to trade in Uganda by dating Zari. He did that to Tanasha Dona, the same thing to Kenya. Very much was a big artist in Kenya, but him dating Tanasha Dona made a very big step that solidified him in Kenya. You get. So I really believe that Diamond and Zuchu are cooking up something that I really feel that is going to backfire at a certain point of time because even the mother has gone ahead to push it a lot like the wedding happened and I will believe that no wedding happened. Of course, if at all it had happened, we would have known and a person with the caliber of Diamond Platinum with the showbiz that he wants to be in and the news he wants to make. I don't believe he can have a wedding and doesn't release the photos. So I really believe that Diamond Platinums and the mother and the family are cooking up something. Let's wait and see. I'll be proved wrong on 11th April, if at all, Diamond Platinums unveils to us the face of the Mugole or the bride. That's when I will be really, oh, I will say, oh my God. I really had a wrong opinion on Diamond Platinums in there. But right now, I fault all what Diamond Platinums and the mom are doing. I don't really believe in it because it's spoiling the career of Diamond Platinums. Because you can't, you can't. You can't drive your, your career on controversies day in, day out. However much Diamond Platinum is a good artist, has given us good music, but controversies are overriding his music. You know, Zari sleeping with such and such a woman, you know, lots of things happening with Diamond Platinum in there. Then with Harmonize, then with Ali Kiba, then with uh, the owner of um, Cloud Media, Diamond Platinum with Davido, you get with banner boy they're having a brawl a cold war you get those are things that whiskey doesn't do davido doesn't do banner boy doesn't do that's why their music careers are really raising to the levels of them performing in every side of america and the entire europe you get diamond would have been planning on how is he going to fill up the auto arena this year you get because david has done it Whiskey has done it, Banner Boy has done it, Tiwa Savage has done it, and even the likes of Adekunde Gold are going to the Auto Arena, you get, in August. And Diamond Platinum, who has some big songs and is a bigger artist than Adekunde Gold, has not yet gone there. And now he's flaunting Zuchu that 
is a separate marriage, a separate, it's a private marriage took place, and we are all onto that. That is really being short sighted, according to me. I really believe that Diamond should get into the better ways of really doing this game better than he expects it to be in there. So, guys, feel free to go into the comment section and tell me what you think about Diamond Platinum's mother confirming their private wedding in there and with an influential woman. Who happens to be Zuchu in there because the most influential women right now in Tanzania from Zanzibar, apart from their president, Salami Yasulu, is Zuchu. Zuchu, very influential from Zanzibar, and she's turning things around with her music career in there for you. All that and more in the comment section below. I'll be reading them and replying to you personally. Let's keep the vibe going.